Generic greetings and welcome back to Sydney's Railroads once again. Today's beverage is ah, it's still that ginger beer. So in the previous episode, we pretty much lost the game from the get-go. We putting on the hardest difficulty and all the hardest routing setting was not really conducive to getting any sort of win into the game. But we well we haven't lost yet, so we've got that going for us, which is nice. But either way. Um, what we're doing this episode is trying to see what we can expand to and hopefully not be the first person to be bought out, but I don't know if I can promise that. Uh, I'm just going to try and bid outbid Jim Hill here just because it'll annoy him. So, uh, What I'm trying to do is double track up to um, Ipswich or from Ipswich. We'll double track here and that's because we want to have it so we can... Um, we want to have it so we can have two trains from Norwich to Ipswich, one of them carrying all these bobbins and all the textiles, um, and then the other one uh, for passengers and mills. So we're going to edit this trains, uh, this trains concert. So we'll clear all of the cars, and we'll just say fill it up with um, with clothing. And we could clear this, we could, but we're not because it's going to take ages to do that. Then we'll have another train, same destinations but just different uh, cargo. So it's passengers and mail. Actually, you know what? I am going to edit the one I've just made because if we're... If we are um, doing passengers and mail at that speed, then we don't really need to have it like that. We can just have one. Yeah, that's fine. Anyway, so where are we at? It's going to cost me 15 million to buy all of my stock. That's not going to happen. Um, we're still waiting for these cars to unload. Ipswich, uh, let me just knock it up to max speed here. Ipswich is now a... T well, we're going to make it a terminal. There we go. So it's a lot quicker now for them to unload and unload. Um, a lot of my trains are getting on a bit. Yeah, that's pretty good. See, preferred, preferred passenger, but quite frankly, it's just... Uh, actually, it's not better for... A lot of things, so we won't upgrade that. We'll wait for the next train, which will be the electric one, probably? I don't know, actually. And look at that. That guy's actually got a like a goldish coloured train. You can colour the trains. I Can you, in fact? Actually, hang on. Hang on! Oh, he is using that train. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I was going to say, what? Well, why can't I do that? Um, I don't know how you change the colour. There's the new train. It's a 42 Johnson Midland Spinner. Mixed cargo and also 60 miles an hour. Yes, you can order it, uh, alter it. You can go customise train. Ah. Oh, um, we, uh, we, uh, may have been, may have been bought out. Um, which is not entirely what I was after. Uh, yeah, I th someone just bought me out. Um, so, there's the end of that, I guess. Okay, because I don't like the idea of being defeated about two minutes into the episode, what we're going to do, or what I have done, is restarted this thing. Not on the stupid difficulty, that would just be insane, but rather we've got for the, we went for the standard difficulty here, and I've gone for the hardest routing level possible, because at least that gives us a bit of a challenge. Um, as you can see, same opponents, we've got uh, Brunel, Jim Hill, and um, Co. We've got a train going from, is this on max speed or what? Game speed is set to f double speed, there we go. We've got a train going from Wrexham to the uh, uh, land road, I'll be clan, clan, it's going there. Uh, and then it's it's got it's got uh, some, some livestock there. But we can also go over to, uh, to Liverpool with a chicken. Right, there we go. Actually, we're not it's not chicken we're carrying, it's um, livestock. Anyway, so we'll have a train going from there to there. And I said to there. Sell there. Yeah, sell my own stock. Yeah, that's a that's a good idea. That worked out last time. Yeah, I don't know whether that was the main problem last step there uh, with the with the last game because having having um well, all of your stock selling it straight away. Not ideal, is it? It's not ideal, but the problem is I didn't have enough cash to do anything, really, so I think it's, you know, what can you do? 
what can you do really at that point? Um, stockyard, I'm going to uh, try and buy it out. Obviously, there's going to be a lot of horrible people uh, trying to buy it out. I mean, I say horrible people, but they're not. They're just, they're just you know, they're looking after their interests and stuff. Um, I mean, I'm not going to go as far to say George is going to be the first one to be bought out by me if I can actually get there. Uh, but we'll see how it goes. And he's already making me pay well above the odds for this stockyard. There's a nice new train. Um, oh, George, you... <clears throat> Insert generic insult here. And our profanity. There we go, that's bought out. Right, so we are going from Liverpool to Wrexham. There's some cattle over there, which would be good to take there. We've also got um, this, thing which turns nitrates into medicine. But we have also got, as you can see here, uh, a wool company. So we can take it there. But the problem is... How do we get there? And I don't really know. I'm going to double track this um, in the city with no name. Uh, and it's not even a city, it's a town. We'll max that out, wait until full, go to there, clear the track and come back. Um, I might as well edit that and say wait until full. Because, quite honestly, there's no reason not to. Um, so, we... Oh, new speed record by him. Very nice. What we'll also do is double track to here to Wrexham. And we'll go from there. Food. Go to Wrexham. Just come back. Just back and forward. Might as well fill it. Wait until full. Back and forward. Back and forward. Actually, because of the distance. I mean, you could just you could probably just roll the cans downhill. Um, I don't think we can food. But either way, it's there. Yeah, we'll just go back and forward, back and forward, back and forward. No problem. Uh, this place will eventually turn into a... Um, it's currently just a village. It'll turn into a town. Um, and then it'll actually want passengers and such. For this thing, for the wool company, what we're going to do is double track once more here. Um, and then have a special track that curves right round. Moderate uphill, sadly. But it's the only way I can realistically do it, I think. Going up to there. And then put that there. That's the wrong one. Nitrates. Wait until full. Go back. Clear the car. Come back. All right. Job done. Uh, what I could do, what I could have done actually, is connect it on the other side and have it as a full loop. But uh, yeah, we'll not bother. Uh, buy the chemical plant out. Hip up here. And see if we can get this one. So uh, where are our competitors? We got someone right down south. Uh, George Stevenson, the Dan Seth. And we've got Brunel on the right, and then also on the right, Jim Hill. Okay, fine. Um, Cardiff. Again, south there. Um, on the west, nothing. Um, it would be nice to have that cattle taken elsewhere, but it's just not going to happen. Uh, what we'll do, we will have Liverpool... Connected to Manchester. I'm just going to triple track this thing. Uh, we will upgrade that to a terminal. And then we'll have this one coming out. And I really want... I want it to go over there. Moderate downhill. don't want a moderate downhill. Oh, God, look at that. If I actually went to... That's a gentle uphill going to Manchester. Oh, look at that. There we go. I'm oh, sorry, going to Birmingham. Looks like uh, European vacation vacationers invade. Tourists take sites, and uh, that means better money. I believe it's uh, better for the transport of... Uh, I think it's better for passengers. I think that's what the event does. Bloody tourists coming over here, taking our pictures. Right, uh, we'll have... <laughs> we'll, we'll sell some uh, stock, and then we'll... Put that in Birmingham. And... I think 3 and 2 is generally the best way for it. Because it's just fast. It's going fast. Um, and just after I've built all of this, we now we have the uh, Buckingham Shaw Malleable Rails patent. We'll try and bid on that. We should be okay. Um, I'm going to start buying a bit more of my stock. In fact, I'll start buying out other people's stock. Nope. There we go. Shouldn't have bought stock out because now I don't have the cash to actually win this if someone else bids. 
we lucked out. Nobody else bid on it. Okay, so Birmingham requires coal. We do have coal from there. And that means uh, this is... Oh, it does actually make steel as well. So if we're going to get into the arms uh, business, probably be the way forward. Look at that. That's a bridge and a tunnel. Actually, this isn't a tunnel, but if we, if we moved it slightly around, it would have been what I want. Uh, so we'll say fill up with coal. Go to there. Oh, in fact, it's, it's, oh, it's not coal. Then we'll clear the track. Um, that's in Birmingham. Then that'll make arms. So what we'll do then, we'll buy the steel mill. Um, need a bit more money before I do that. And then we'll take uh, arms to... Oh, no. Liverpool also has that. But because of where we are situated, it's better off owning the one in Birmingham. Also, we have a miss mission to deliver some stuff there. So we'll start buying the steel mill. We'll also buy a bit more of my own stock. Um, bit of George's just to annoy him, because uh, <laughs> that's the word we're rolling here. It looks like we've won that one. Yeah, that that in that uh, barren difficulty is very, very difficult. I'm not entirely sure how one would go about winning that. Um, right, so arms. This. Doesn't make arms. What makes arms? Oh, sorry. Liverpool. Right. Liverpool does make. Ah, yes. It turns steel into arms. Okay. Pirates played coal shippers, so demand for domestic production heats up. Pirates? Train pirates. Well, train robbers, I guess, wouldn't it? But not nicking coal, surely. <laughs> Maybe. Huh? Strange. Um. So this is carrying. We're going to change this, change the concert, so it's going to pick up passages from Liverpool, but Birmingham is going to bring coal, uh, it's going to bring a couple of passengers back, but mainly steel, mainly steel. Um, that's still supplying quite well. Where's the nearest other coal? It is, I'm rewarded with £100,000 for delivering stuff. Buy my own stock. Buy a bit of yours. Buy a bit of yours. Buy a bit of yours. This is working out. Uh, Sandbok. Baldwin Sandbok patent. I'm pretty sure there's just been an achievement there. There's 25% traction on inclines, and because I'm in Wales, there's a fair bit of that. Uh, as you can see, I'm going to have to sell a bit of my own stock here. Yep. Sell a bit of my own stock just to get there. Oh, that's very pretty. Look at that. All the, all the trees that were. Oh, that's nice. One likes that. With a massive iron girder running through the entire area. Right. Um, we still didn't go to Manchester. So let's resolve a to that problem by... Well, by going to Manchester. Um, I always... Well, I, oh, I often do that. I often... Go to put something down when there ain't a station there. I can follow with these passengers, you see. Uh, we've still got that rare call up there and what I'll do double track quite frankly my dear tunnel under the entire mountain it uh, looks like Mayor of Cheltenham solicits railway well I won't be going there it's quite a distance um can I go all the way through here yes I can let's see what that looks like ho 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 that's a tunnel Oh yes, that is a big, big tunnel. Right, you, oh, go back to there with oh, and then clear the track, clear the car because we don't want to haul that all the way there. Uh, this is or will be making bombs. Let's start buying out the war factory and see how that one goes because there's loads of steel going there, and then that'll make a bombs, and then the bombs will take. To be honest with you, we could just take it back to. Back to Birmingham. We're going to alter that then. Um, we're not going to carry passengers. Oh, we will carry passengers, but we'll bring bombs back and all. Bombs. Uh, not that one, not. There we go. Okay. Cool. Uh, did we wait until full? That's the question. We're not waiting until full. That is okay with me. So we still got this cattle company not doing squat. Uh, we have probably a bit of load balancing to deal with over here now because that's generating okay. That's waiting. That is not too bad, though. 
That one's just taking food back and forward, but we don't have uh, any call for that amount of food anymore. So we're going to get rid of one of those and then put um, two passengers, three mail. And that should be about right, I think. Anyway, let's just start buying a bit more stock. And... It's going to be Brunel. Uh, oh, good, yes. Uh, the, the, the shield patent, half the cost to build tunnels. Yeah, it would be nice to have that before that one appeared. Anyway, let's um, start upgrading all of these trains to um, train that ain't crap because... Um, oh, not, we're not because I know that the next train is fairly decent, so we're not going to do that. I am going to keep buying out Jim, to be quite honest with you, because Jim does have a fair bit of land over on the right-hand side, and if I can if I can buy him out early, then that's going to help me out in the long run. It also cuts into Brunel's profits, because he's over there as well. And I'll siphon it off to me. Right, so we've got ooh, a lot of steel there. A lot of steel, so we're going to upgrade that train to a better train. There we go. And it immediately goes faster. Because of the amount of steel we're we're, we've got there, though, I am going to edit this, and I am going to just simply delete all of the people, uh, passengers and stuff. Because um, we don't need to take passengers. Liverpool's pretty much Manchester and Liverpool. That's where all of that's going. So it's only really Birmingham with any uh, any passengers so what I'll do is that's the one I was waiting for that's the, oh that's the freight one um well, that's fine because we do have a, couple, a lot of freight that's not freight that is freight that is sort of freight but it's just best they're just better anyway so everything's getting upgraded I, I missed that one out go and there we go that's all done all right so uh, we will make sure that Birmingham is a terminal because I want to double track once more to there to a very 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 sharp end and then head over to oh I said Cheltenham I thought that was miles away but it ain't it's there um okay I was thinking of Chelmsford that's why <laughs> right so that's going there um someone's also built here George you horrible Baron you. Um, that's, they're wanting nitrates. Well, they ain't gonna get them, because the only place for nitrates, really, is there. Well, actually, there's probably one closer. Um, there's one there. Oh, no, that's supply. No, that's demand there. This is the supply. Yeah, it's the closest one. Um, the one going back and forward here, what we can probably do is upgrade this to a terminal. Wrexham should already be a terminal, which it is. And then we're going to double track. Like so. Add another train. Um, fill that up to there. Go there. Clear that. And then medicine. So one's food, one's medicine. Picked up but not delivered. Ah, oh, I'll need to build a hospital. Okay. Build... Hospital. Hospital's been made. Food? Actually, you know what? Because of the distance, that'll be perfectly sufficient. Five. There. There. Done. Okay. This one. Edit. Um, there you go. Done. So just, it's not going to go food anymore. Right. We're sorted. A uh, bit more of gym to buy. So, I did do the app. So, Birmingham's now going okay. That's all of the... That's the arms coming back. And then they'll be still going away. Yeah, that's fine. Cheltenham sorted. Cardiff ain't doing squat. But we could probably go ahead and... Track all the way to Cardiff. Like so. Add station there and then because we don't know where these are going to be like going in I'm going to increase the track like that and basically you just join up all the tracks to this back one so it means if it it, it can pick whichever um, station it needs to so there and back to Cardiff back and forward alright um, 
That's fine. Could buy a bit more stock. So I will own Jim Hill's company probably shortly. There's only Jim that owns one bit of the stock, and that's it. Look at all the money I'm getting. It's the money I'm I'm getting loads of money because of the uh, the arms. That's why I'm getting a load of cash because it's I believe it's probably the most expensive here. Um, yeah, look at that. Fifty thousand a unit. Right, so I need. 2.6 million to buy out Jim. Um, I need probably about maybe 6 million for George. I'll see what happens when I buy the last bit of his stock. Uh, 6 million. Yeah. Guess about right. And then Brunel is going to be probably. Ah, looks like Jim's buying some of their stock there. And he's actually owned one of his other stock there, so he's bought out a bit more. There's also being one just... Yeah. To... Oh, someone's buying mine as well. Yeah, it looks like he's buying a bit more of Brunel's stock. I don't know why. It increases his value, I believe, his share value. Because if he owns stuff, then yeah, he has uh, stakes in that company. Um... So it's going to be, to buy a Brunel and George, it's six and a half million, essentially. Jim, it's going to be two and a half million. Uh, I've still got stock to buy on mine, but I don't think it matters. I'm worth 22 million and rising very, very quickly. The next highest is 7 million for George. So I think we can call that a bit of a win. I would go ahead and actually finish this off, but quite frankly, it is... There's not much building else... There's not really a lot more building to be done because most of it's already built on. I mean, we could go down to here and stuff and we just expand that. But in reality... I sit for five minutes and then I win the game. So we'll call it there. Not a bad episode at all. Hmm... Certainly didn't go overly well at the uh, start because, you know, after all, we did lose. But it's interesting trying the harder difficulty. Harder. The hardest difficulty. I'm uh, interested in knocking into a couple of notches for the next time we do this. But uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.